Hag, did you ever pick any cotton? Pick any cotton? <laughs> I picked cotton long before I ever picked guitar. A lot more of it, too. Mm, me, too. You, have you really picked cotton, Roy? Yeah, I already did. I picked uh, uh, every year until one year I caught the cotton wagon on fire. <laughs> wouldn't let me pick no more. <laughs> you ever put dirt clod in your sack? Yeah, we all did. Oh. <laughs> you know, talking about picking cotton. I remember an old black man used to pick the same field every year, along with my bunch. He get to humming the blues when he's picking. Mm. Faster he'd hum, faster he'd pick. Sounds something like this right here. Talking about picking cotton. You ever wake up in the morning and see a little white cloud in the sky and pray for a miracle and hope to hell it rains before you get to the batch? <laughs> yeah. Did you ever be with your dad, watch your dad stand on a 37 Ford, look at the best patch across, you know, see what you're going to do? Oh, see if he could find another patch? Yeah, a better patch. No, nah, uh, my dad had a Chevy. Oh, well, that makes a difference. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Yeah. He used to pick up an old boy named Bill Hobbs. Old Bill, he had a good outlook on life. He, he said, boys, let's get out there and get us about 500 pounds and go home around noon. <laughs> he used to say, there ain't no limit, boys, what a man make one of these cotton beans. <laughs> old Bill used to play a French harp. He used to carry his hip pocket. Yeah. You, you play a French harp, don't you? Yeah, I carry my front pockets. So. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> a little bit, a little bit. Do you play? Yeah, a little Let's bit. Let's see if you do. <laughs> <laughs> 